lots of amigos. Today we're looking at the dynamics of a tent. So this is a typical tent, one of those triangular ones. And we have a Z plane going up through the tent. The flow is going from left to right, zero to 30 meters per second. So kind of like you're in a hurricane and you're tenting for some reason. And the flow is around the edges. It really separates quite a lot. You can see there's, um, there's these bubbles kind of forming on each side. And then the flow is now faster around the edges. And then there's quite a big wake behind. And then at the front, there's quite a big wake as well. Oh, sorry, quite a big deceleration of flow. It's not really a wake, I guess you'd say. Interestingly, as you get higher, so you saw those bubbles, they were getting bigger than below. And then as we get to the top, the wake really just dies out. So it's not too bad. So here, we're almost at the top and there's really no wake anymore. So the top is not too bad. It's really the middle part. That's the juicy section. And these are streamlines going from left to right with the flow. And what we're seeing here is what we saw in the other video where the flow coming over the middle section, there is a bit of recirculation. You can see a couple streamlines coming around. And so just there you can see how close the streamlines are to the edges, to the top and bottom, but around the middle, it, it's much further away from the actual surface of the tent. And you can see on this side as well, actually, there are some streamlines that are recirculating in that juicy middle section. And then all these streamlines are hitting the front and they have to go over. So that's why we get a huge uh, pressure at the front of this tent. So make sure to like subscribers and share it with any buddies who are going tenting soon. I'm sure they'll be interested to know. And check out the information we do at Premier Dynamics here. We do atmosphere hawk. We do the uh, PIV and traverses. Check out the courses we do like CFD, like this, if you want to get better at CFD. If you don't want to get better at CFD, that's your business, whatever. And check out the uh, experimental and theoretical courses we do. Check out the International Aerospace Conference put on every year. Peace out, amigos.